Hi, welcome back. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a simple toggle switch effect with a HomeKit button or switch using the Home app and shortcuts within the Home app. Now, normally with any kind of button or switch, when you press it, it triggers a scene or an automation or a single item. Uh, now, with this effect that I'm going to show you today, you can say single press on something and if the lights are on they'll turn off and if the lights are off they'll turn on so in effect that's a toggle switch with just one action now with switches normally you can't create automations for them i'll demonstrate here so if i go to the automations tab click plus and select an accessory is controlled you can see for instance the eve button is here but if i select it it says go to settings programmable switches must be set up from the settings screen so that's not the way you normally would be able to do it so if we go back into rooms and then i've got my eve button here so i select that long press now at the moment you can see i've got three actions single press lights low double press lights bright or long press lights out I'm going to go into single press and I'm going to delete this action. So that's blank now. So what I'm going to do is instead of selecting a scene or an accessory that it controls with a single press, I'm going to scroll all the way to the bottom and I'm going to select convert to shortcut. I'm going to delete the first panel because we don't need that at the moment. So I'm then going to, going to create an action. So the first thing is if, and then basically I need to select a device that is part of a scene that I want to, the uh, the button to control. So I know that previously this button was using lights low. So I want to be able to select one of the devices that was in that scene. So if I go to input, select a home accessory. If I scroll along, one of my devices was the Smart Glow 1. So I'm going to click Done. And then I in the name section, which is a little bit odd, I'm going to select is on and then i'm going to select plus control new type a that's my home and then i'm going to select scenes and accessories so if the light is on i want the light to go off so i'll select lights out next done so i'm going to drag that up so if smart glow one is on set lights out otherwise can you guess? Control new type A, select scenes and accessories, light slow. Done. And then let's drag that up to just below otherwise. So if the smart glow one is on, set the lights out. Otherwise, set lights low. So in other words, if the smart glow one is not on, then it'll set the lights to low which is the scene that I had previously. So I'm going to click Next, click Done. And there you see now the single automation or scene has been replaced by two scenes. And that's it. So now let's see this uh, automation in action. So here's the Eve button, and there's one of the lights that are part of the scene. Single press on, single press off. Single press on, single press off. Thanks again, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.